Yo, Lob City, you wanted a Historic Warriors pack. Well, we're going to open up a Historic Warriors pack then. What's good, everybody? I'm back again with another video. We got the JV in action. That means we have some guys that got demoted in the last video. You'll get to see James Harden and Blake Griffin coming down, actually getting more minutes now that they're on the JV. Will they have a chance to bounce back and make it back to the varsity? And guys, leave a comment down below of what pack you want to see opened up next. And think about this. Blake is a Sapphire card, and he's down here on the JV with Ruby Iguodala. These guys are known to play well, and they want to get called up. So just like that, we have to do something. As you see, Steph Curry, who I introduced in my USA video, he's on the JV as well. He's trying to buy for a spot on the varsity. As we have to deal with AI, Paul George at shooting guard, LeBron James, Sapphire Durant and Dwight Howard. Dwight is another card that I have not got yet. As we come down, starting the game off, D Rose going in, all knees in the chest, getting that layup. But he comes right back with AI, and AI is fouled. He is going to be the difference maker in this game for sure. As we drive down, kick it out to Iguodala, who wants to be back on that varsity. We have three great players at small forward, shooting guard, and power forward. And there's only two spots that's gonna get called up, so who's gonna make it back to the varsity? You gotta watch this video. Let me know in the comment section down below who's going to make it. As we get this steal with D Rose, he gives it up to Iggy. Nothing in transition. They did a good job of getting back. So we set things up. We find Horford. Horford gets a double team. We kick it over to Blake, and Blake attacks the rim, getting that layup. So we're playing smart basketball, trying to limit the turnovers because the turnovers can kill you. As we get a steal with James Harden, he sees this as an opportunity. He knows that it's hard for two guards to go. So he's got to outplay Iguodala here today as D Rose fouls once again. There's nothing you can do about it. He just goes back and forth with AI. And if you try to block his shot, they automatically call a foul. I don't get it. But D Rose has it for him in transition, kicking it up to Froby. Froby knocks down that three to give him a lead. We had to get a quick timeout. Now we get a turnover and they're going the other way. We turn that rock over and PG is finishing at the rim. Now Paul George was just as close to getting demoted as well. So we have to see what happens on the varsity next game as he kills me with a three from Curry. He's got some identical cards to me as he comes right back with AI. I'm not even playing on ball anymore and I should have because that's his third foul and D Rose has to sit out now. After missing his free throw with Blake, Iverson goes once again. He's bringing the ball up the floor, and no one's guarding him, and he knocks down the transition three-pointer. That's just horrible team defense. I know we have Gary Payton and Mark Gasol as our defenders, but we got to have somebody else step up. But James Harden comes back and gets a three on the wing of his own. And just like that, he inbounds the ball quickly, but we get the turnover as Blake Griffin playing solid defense. We try to reward him, but Iguodala said, let me get that. It's like they're competing with each other right now. But now, AI has it going back and forth, pulls up the leaner right over it. A Flalo, a Flalo, you may be gone from the JV. You haven't given me anything since I brought you here, and it's tough. We're trying to find that second scorer off the bench since a lot of our scores have went to the varsity as we have a beautiful play set up right there with that pick and roll feed to the post and back cut now we get the steal we're going the other way he's trying to take that charge we're feeding parsons once again parsons who was cut from the usa basketball team which was an outrage he should have made the team he's playing well here today now iguodala hitting another three-pointer iguodala is feeling it right now he has not even missed a shot this game we get it over to Harden. Harden pulls up on the wing. He misses. And Howard snags the rebound for them. And AI throws the lob up to Paul George. That is the one thing that we have to deal with. Paul George is shooting guard with LeBron James. They have a lot of length on the wings as we get this flush with DeAndre Jordan doing what he does best. And that's dunking the ball as we get blocked right here. They're pushing it up. LeBron pulls up in transition, knocks down that jump shot. Foot was on the line, which is the worst shot in basketball. He only gets two points for that. But we just dump it down to Blake Griffin off the give and go on the inbound. We had Joe Kim Noah looking at the ball and not his man. And right here, we don't get down to play defense. And Paul George makes us pay. So we're down nine. 
James Harden's calling for that screen, doing what he does best. He wish he had Blake to roll a little bit quicker, but he didn't. Blake gets three defenders on him. He's able to kick it out, and Iguodala knocks down that three. Iguodala is playing lights out. I'm sorry, Iguodala, you may have to earn it, but at the same time, I think you already have it. As they get another bucket, we're down 12. We swing it back out. Iguodala's waiting on a screen from Kevin Love. And Kevin Love is just a decoy as Blake Griffin finishes at the rim with the left hand, shielding off the defender right there. Down 10, he's going the other way. We're trying to get that inbound steal, and we're going to pay for it as Aldridge is just getting double teamed, and we just don't come. I call for the double team, and nothing happens. It's a 12-point game, five seconds left, but we have Steph Curry. He tries to get me with the charge cheese, and from deep, a deep three we get that to go now it's a seven point game d rose back out there kicking it down to gasol he's double team we swing it over to blake who can't hit that shot he kicks it out and on the elbow james harden is able to knock that down making it a five point game but he comes right back with lebron james and lebron james gets us up in the air and he's able to feed the post for another bucket and lebron decided hey it's time to take this bad boy over now he has Chandler Parsons on him. We double team him and we pop the steal out of nowhere. Now D Rose throws it over to Blake who gets the and one on the play as he makes the and one to make it a two point game. He comes right back with Kevin Durant, the MVP. That was heartbreaking. What a big time three right in my face. It was a dagger basically. We thought we had this, but he comes right down low with Dwight Howard, two people on him and he still finishes. So just like that, it was a two-point game. It's looking like this game may be getting out of reach as he's going on a late run here. We're trying as hard as we can. It's a five-point game. We have to get something here. But he hit us with an alley-oop. So it looks like we're not going to get this win. We got to at least try to pop a three here. We got GP pulling up. And GP misses. So we end up losing this ball game, guys. The JV squad had some guys stand out here today. At the end of the video, you'll see the stats and you let me know which two should get called up. So y'all be good and I'll have another video out real soon.